So we are doing a weather unit in first grade, and we decided to compare the weather with a class in Montana, since the climates are so different. So we used a webcam and got on Skype to video conference with them. So we were able to compare what the weather was like for a whole week. Um, during that time, the kids were keeping graphs online. They were using internet sources to look up highs and lows and look up weather patterns and um, if it was going to rain and that kind of a thing. So they spent that week comparing and keeping track of what it was like. After that, they took a whole week where they learned how to predict based on the previous week. So they were able to go on to VoiceThread and make predictions for um, what they thought it would be like in Montana, and Montana did that for us and what they thought it might be like here. So then the kids were able to get on and respond and say whether their predictions were right or wrong. So it involved a lot of that higher level thinking with predicting and comparing, and it was really, really great in that way. Um, the kids kept weather journals during this time so that um, while one group was maybe in front of the webcam or in front of the voice thread, the rest of them were able to be involved um, with doing that paper paperwork with their predicting and their uh, just tracking what the weather was like. Um, as part of our project, we were able to contact Corey McCluskey from Fox 10, and he came in. Um, originally, I wanted him to video conference with us and just share some of his weather knowledge, but he was actually was able to come in and sit down with the kids and get, share with them um, what he knew knows about the weather, and they were able to ask questions. We had the Montana people up on the webcam so they could ask questions as well, and the kids really learned a lot from him. And he broadcasted live on the, the Arizona Fox 10 Today morning show for families to see, and it was a, a great experience for the kids. Now, have you guys met any of the kids? Do you know any of their names back there? Really? Now, who do you know? Um, oh, yeah, you know Tanner? Well, uh, we Tanner, is Tanner back there? Can Tanner stand up and show off his uh, handsome face? There you go, from 2,000 miles away. And as a final product for this project, the kids made their own weather broadcasts where we used our smart board um, sort of as a big backdrop. They had um, like a radar map up behind them and different images that they could fly in. 90 degrees. The high, high is 83 and the low for tonight is 50. 